So I'm here again at the, uh, or still, at the Brewstall in Elkins, West Virginia. And this is a hostel here. They used to have a brewery downstairs, but it, it shut down about a year ago. But uh, the, the, the hostel is really cool. It's got 12 beds here. So if you're ever having some kind of uh, group thing, this would be kind of a cool place to do it. This is the living room. It's not really big, but there's outside spaces out there. Uh, and uh, really nice little kitchen here to do any kind of cooking you want. And, microwave even uh, one of those Keurig things very fancy so this is the first bunk room and uh, this is the cabin room is what they call it and check this out and you see the, the lamp here the lamps are classy and then they got uh, over here the saw and antlers over there and these are the, the coat hooks they did with these hooks which is really cool and then all these saws over there so this is the cabin room and the cabin room has the bathroom like over there on the other side of the kitchen. And then this is the caboose room where I'm staying. And you can see it's red and the railroad crossings. And these are railroad ties they've used as the, the hooks over here, which is cool. And so, you know, I know. Oh, and these are really cool. Check it out. This is the uh, little longer thing. And these lift up and your bag is in there. Put it in. This one, you got to bring your own padlock. Sweet Peas Hostel and Ash will provide you with padlocks and a lot of other stuff. But they have a cool lamp over here. And then, and then this one has its own bathrooms. So you get two showers, nice wood walls here, and uh, tile floors, and then toilets. Two of them. So anyway, I just thought this is really kind of a, a cool, unique way to use whatever's sticking out of the wall there. <laughs> uh, and they got their rules on how to live in the caboose room and be respectful of others. Oh, check out the stove. Isn't this cool? Uh, so that's probably how they actually really get heat here in the wintertime. I don't know. But it is July now here in West Virginia. And I'm taking off to Ohio today. But I'm glad I got to stay in my eighth state, which was really cool because as I was heading my way out of Virginia yesterday, my odometer hit. 8,888.8 miles and I watched it happen and then I went to my eighth state which is here in West Virginia. So today I shoot for number nine. Uh, uh, it's been great staying here at the Brewstool. I do recommend if you ever come through it's only 25 bucks for to stay in the bunk and uh, you get a group of people you probably get a discount who knows but what what happens at the Brewstool stays at the Brewstool so uh, it's a beautiful thing. All right, well, I'll show you outside this from here. Hey, you know what? You want to go out on the roof while we're here? So this is the outside area. This table has not been cleaned in quite a while. They all, they haven't had anybody stay here in like three days um, before I got here. And the last group was like a group of college students or something, so they had to clean the whole place. But. So, a few steps to get up here, and a few more steps, but you can see how beautiful that view is of that Appalachian or Appalachian skyline. I have found that depending on the region you're in, it is either pronounced Appalachian or Appalachian. And those who are committed will fight to the death to prove that their way of saying it is the right way. Anyway, this is the rooftop up here at the uh, Brewstall. And uh, a sunset over there yesterday, and I shot a nice little video doing Country Roads Taking Home. And I played it for everybody who could hear, which probably wasn't a whole lot of people, because not a lot of people out and about uh, at any time of day. But they do have a train museum over there which is cool, apparently. There were trains through here. And there's that cool old bridge back there that a train ran across. I haven't seen any trains, but I haven't really been looking for them either. Anyway, I just wanted to give you a little bit more detail about the Brewstool. And I imagine there was a time that this hammock was really nice to lay in. Today is not one of those times. It's a little, it's a little broked, but yeah, this is Elkins, 
West Virginia. It's a small town. Unfortunately, there's a lot of the places uh, on the street that aren't open, but there are a few. Some business is thriving. From what I read on the interwebs, the uh, economy's coming back and all of that. But a lot of beautiful old buildings here. Built back in 1906. So it's 1924. but they're built to last. Anyway, if you're coming through this way, stay at the Brewstool, tell them that I said hi, and uh, they even let you make coffee. So, I'm gonna go put together a newsletter to include all this stuff for those of you who are out there watching. And so, thanks, and have a great day.